The United Nations on Wednesday described Israel's ban on Secretary General Antonio Guterres as political posturing by its foreign minister and insisted that the world body's contacts with Israel will continue because they must. The United Nations spokesman, Stefan Dujaric, told reporters that Israel's foreign minister, Israel Katz, declaring on UN chief persona non grata was yet another attack by the Israeli government on UN staff. Tensions have escalated since the Hamas attack on October 7, which killed around 1,200 people in Israel and prompted a major Israeli military response that has left more than 41,000 Palestinians dead, according to Gaza's health ministry. The situation has deteriorated further with Israeli incursions into Lebanon and rocket attacks from Iran. The UN Security Council held an emergency meeting on the Middle East conflict. Antonio Guterres has called for an end to the escalating violence, but did not address the travel ban while attending the meeting. Israel Katz accused Guterres of bias against Israel and claimed he had failed to condemn the actions of Hamas. The United Nations spokesman denied the accusations, saying Guterres has repeatedly condemned terrorist attacks and sexual violence. Israel has also accused the United Nations Reliefs and Works Agency, which assists Palestinian refugees, of colluding with Hamas. The agency's Commissioner General, Felipe Lazzarini, claimed Israel was trying to undermine its operations, which provide essential services to millions of Palestinians. Guterres criticized Israel for collective punishment against Palestinians, noting an unprecedented level of destruction during his tenure as Security General. Stefan Dujaric stressed that while UN staff may be declared personal non grata by a country, this does not apply to the Secretary General.